But we started our day at the Sea of Galilee, there it is, in the tribe of Zebulun and Naphtali, at the Aliyah Return Center, which is right there. Here we go. It is dangerous to your lives, and it is against the Israeli law. Olive trees. Jeremiah 31 verse 5, again, on the vineyards of, okay, again, you will plant vineyards on the hills of Samaria. Judea and Samaria. We never did get the full promise settled. Watch them call. The full promise was that we would be able to settle all the way, including all this other side, you know, which we never fully did yet. All the way to the Euphrates, all the way down to the Nile River is the promised land. So thank you for your prayers. As it's the year-end time where charities usually raise their budget for the next year, if we have a 501c3 you can give to in the United States. May God bless you from the Galilee. Started our day, we went down the Jordan River, down the Jordan River. We went right by the crossing point by Jericho, where the children of Israel crossed in, right above the Dead Sea was the crossing point right here. So we, we went here, we started looping up through the mountains of Ephraim in the land of Samaria. So this whole, there isn't one of these called Samaria. There's Judea, Samaria, Galilee. That's how, that's how the thing is, Judea, Samaria, Galilee, areas of Israel, okay? We wound up through here, and you notice how here all the colors are together? Because they hadn't settled yet. They were following a guy called Joshua, and this guy cast lots right here in the capital. He said, this is gonna be the capital of Israel, Shiloh, and the Ark of the Covenant is gonna stop and rest here for how long? 369 years. Kind of a long time. The whole Turkish mandate, pretty much. The, okay? This was our capital. There was no Jerusalem yet. No Jerusalem yet. This was the capital right here, 369 years. And they cast the lots and they're like, we're going to go forth from here. 